I learned to build teams early. I learned the value card system growing up. What's the value card system? Is that you know when you're from a family of 11 kids, um, you, you're expected to know what value you bring to that family. And everybody has a very different card. And the moment that you try to play somebody else's card, then you get told, that's not your value card. Why are you playing your sister's value card, right? And so when I went in the military, you know, I was, I, look, I, I walked in the military day one understanding what my value card was. And so no one had to tell me that. And so as I navigated my way through the military, I played that card so well. I perfected that card. I worked on that card. My value card is leadership. If, if you put me in any room, no one's gonna guess who's in charge. No one's gonna guess who's leading. You know, I know that card. I can walk into a room and people say, who's in charge? And when you ask that question, that's an opportunity to take charge. And so I, I, I operated like that through the military. That's why I got some great assignments. That's why I got picked for some tough jobs. Um, you know, one time I had a leader tell me, it was like, you're, you know, he said, I asked, why did I get this job? I was the least qualified for the job. I couldn't understand that. I was the least qualified. And he told me, you weren't the most qualified person for the job. And he said, do you know why you got the job? This was a general. And I said, uh, because I'm good. He goes, no. He, I said, because I am technically proficient. He said, no. He said, you had the greatest potential. He said, you had the greatest potential to lead. He said, I wasn't looking for somebody who was technically proficient. I wasn't looking for somebody um, who had a, a tight resume. He said, I was looking for someone who had the greatest potential to lead. I think that we have a lot of potential that we don't tap into for a lot of reasons. And to me, that comes back to being fearless. You know, are you willing to just step out there and learn something so new? Are you willing to take a job that no one's had before and every, every eye is watching you? Are you willing to be the only person in the room that has the least time, the least experience, and still lead? And that's what I knew. I knew that I was walking into that, that moment that I had never done this before, I had never been a leader, and all eyes was on. And so, so that's what he meant by the greatest potential to lead.